Lay your head down on your pillow. Tie your feather Don't even say my name. This hair is every fucking wear. Hi. What are y'all doing? It's, what time is it? It's 12 o'clock. 12 o'clock. It's 12 o'clock. I just want to have a little discussion with you guys. This discussion is strictly for the women. Grown women. Not little kids. Or single women or maybe the single women can put their opinions in on this i just wanted to ask a question so peep this if y'all hold on let me see something Okay, so if y'all ready, say ready. If y'all ready for me to say what I have to say, say ready. I'm just trying to make sure y'all listening. Because I hate repeating myself. Okay, so. Me and my, um, my boo was having a discussion, right? And we were talking about how, like, different, I want to say, like, how can I put it? We were talking about, like, how y'all, okay, so, okay, I'm going to put it this way. So, y'all know how... When you're in the industry, like, sex sales, like, you just, like, I don't know, like, people just like pretty shit. People like sexy shit. People like shit that they know they can't look like, but they like looking at it on other people. Or they know that they'll never dress like that or be like that, but they like looking at it on other people. So, is it a bad thing to want to give sexy but still want to be respectful to your man like how do you do both of those like how do you still give sexy and give the girls what they want but still be respectful towards your man and he don't feel like you doing a lot Thank you. Thank you. In the comments, bitch, we don't rent in 2021. Well, actually, I I stopped renting in 2020. <laughs> we don't rent, sweetie. We own. We buy. We're making it a trend for bitches to want to buy. Everybody was screaming condo, uh, a high rise. Then the Taylor girls popped out and said, bitch, we're buying. And now everybody want to buy a house. Buying a house was never a trend. Buying a house was, people looked at that as, oh, I'm going to wait till I'm grown. I'm going to wait till I settle down. I'm going to wait till I get kids. Bitch, I'm doing grown woman shit. I ain't on that little kid shit no more. We have been buying. Oh, so somebody said, ask him what's unacceptable to him. I get that, but I feel like everything is going to always be unacceptable to him because I'm his woman and he loves me. So it's like he doesn't want anybody to see me. So I feel like everything is unacceptable to him, if that makes sense. 
it's just like how do you coexist in each other's world where you still get to look sexy for the gram and post what you want but not make him feel no type of way it's like no way to do that right Girl, buying a house is not expensive. Like, what you paying for rent, you pay that in mortgage. It's the same thing. I'm just saying, of course, people, Ben, don't make it a thing where I'm just trying to always make it seem like we doing shit first. I'm just saying the trend was to get a high rise. Everybody want a condo, an apartment, a high rise. Nobody was talking about buying a house building a house nobody was really on that shit for real for real people are, are just now trying to jump on that wave and they're jumping on that wave after being educated and knowing that you're paying all that money and still don't own shit pay that same money and own something Exactly. That's what I be feeling like. I be, I be like, cause like, I'll be like, I'll take a picture and it'll be so fucking cute. And then I'll just know he'll be in his feelings if I post it. So I'll be posting it and then I'll archive it. Then I'll post it again and then archive it. But you want to know something that he said that stuck with me, like, after we had, like, when we was having, like, our little conversation or whatever. He was just like, I know you're going to do what you want to do anyways, but I'm going to just say this. I hear it all the time, but I guess the way he said it to me kind of stuck to me. He was just saying, like, sex is so, like, it's cheap. Like, women are born with sex like we're born to be sexy like it's not hard to be sexy like that's something that's easy that comes natural that every woman have in them and it's cheap like you can get it anywhere like you can fucking pay 2.99 a month for it like you can you can get it anywhere like it's so accessible but a boss isn't And I don't know, that stuck with me. Like, I was just like, damn, he's right. He's so fucking right. It is cheap, and it is everywhere. Fuck, I'm cheap. I need to be more bossy. <laughs> That's what I was thinking in my head. But, I mean, I already know I'm a boss. I feel like sometimes I don't show it enough, though, because I be so into like looks because i love looks i love fashionistic stuff i don't really be on it as much as i should but i love it so when i do get on it i know because i can do both like i could put on a suit and a birkin and eat these bitches up and then i could put on a bodysuit and eat these bitches up or i could be half naked stepping on a nigga face and some red bottles and still eat these bitches up so it just be like a thing that I just be thinking about. <sighs> but I'm young. Like, that's what we do. Like, we like to show our bodies. These bodies don't stay... Like, we don't have these bodies forever. Like, once you start pushing 25 and up, your body don't look the same no more. Like, 
when you in your 20s, you young, you vibrant, you sexy, your titties are sitting up, your ass is sitting up. And I was blessed to have it naturally. So I be trying to show this shit. Like, fuck it. Let me show it. That is. Y'all feel what I'm saying? Like, I feel like once I get older, not saying my titties gonna be saggy, because I swear to God, I go go put them bitches over the ear balloon, uh, um, uh, another ear balloon, but a uh, a a tire pump, a basketball. Uh, air pump if my shits get saggy but it's still like just some shits is it look good i look good Girl said, bitch, I'm 30 and my shit's still sitting up. Girl, you is a lucky one because I know some bitches that's 30 and up and them bitches is not sitting up. You just take care of yourself. I might be in my 30s and my shit might still be sitting up too. I ain't gonna lie because I'm real petite and I don't gain a lot of weight. I'm dead. I love y'all. Y'all are funny. I like talking to y'all. <laughs> what is y'all over here saying? Let me see. Let me make sure his ass ain't on here. Uh, when are y'all gonna stop talking about this man? Like, it feels like out of all my exes, this is the only nigga that y'all talk about and bring up. Like, seriously, like y'all obsession with me and his relationship is really weird. Like, please stop talking about this man. Like, I don't even talk about this man. So why do y'all continue to keep talking about this man? Like, he is living his life, I'm living mine. And that's just that he a millionaire doing what he doing, and I'm a millionaire doing what I'm doing. Like, there's no need to keep talking about him. Y'all feel me? I love you as well. Armand, I didn't see your comment. This is my first time seeing your comment. Shut your ass up. Not even doing nothing over here about trying to bother me. I ain't bothering your ass. At Armand. Armand don't be talking about nothing. Let me see what he's talking about. (laughs) 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 Bro, what you invite me to here for, man? Damn. Bugging out, bro. What's the deal with it? They just told me to add you because you was in my comments talking shit. Talking oh, crazy, trying to act like you don't see nobody coming. I did. I really didn't see your comment. I didn't see your comment till you typed something long. 
What's the deal, gang? So what you think about what I said? What? So if you if you had a female and you knew she was in the industry and you knew she was a badass bitch, you knew that before you got with her, mm. and she want to post her pictures and, you know, show her sexy side, would you be, like, not for it? Hell no. Why would I? No, I don't think I'd not be for it. I mean, I no, I don't think I would not be for it. I mean, you feel me? A nigga may be feeling good one day, post a picture with his shirt off. I mean, I feel like if she ain't, I don't know. Like, that's cool, right? That's cool to me, bro. Sure you know how to dress. Don't be no um sister Yolanda. You feel me? You know what I mean? <laughs> don't be no sister Yolanda. Show a little, a little leg sometimes. You feel me? So you want my her cleaver. showing a little nipple, a little cheek, a little something or two? Oh, bro, we ain't say walk around naked through this. <laughs> we just say, we just say, just you feel me? I can't do that. I don't know about. I, I know what you mean though. It be some that be overboard. Nah, uh, uh. That's what I'm saying. But if she do it in like a tasteful, classy way, where it's not like a hoish way, like this bitch just look like hold out, like you and mine, right? Right. No, heck, hell no, nah, no, nah, uh, uh. I so you not one of them type of niggas that be long like, as you ain't embarrassing yourself and myself by trying to look that way and you don't look good, like okay then. But if you like, yeah, do it, do your thing. You feel me? Because I ain't gonna lie, don't let me look nasty in the mirror with the six pack out. Because I'm posting, you hear me? Posting. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't got no. I mean, I'm still in the gym. I'm still in the gym. Yeah. I'm still in the gym. Mind you, I'm in the gym too. Mind you, I'm. Uh, my, never mind, I ain't gonna play like that. Mm. <laughs> I'm, I, I ain't gonna play like that, mind you, I'm, bro. Damn. I ain't gonna play like that. You Yo, just want you us to see your fucking teeth. Show us your teeth. Damn, let me see. Bro, you just be chatting, bro. Like, you just be so corny. Do you not know we on live, bro? Ain't nobody, they finna just be all in my DM seeing that now. You just trying to, ain't nobody trying to see mom like this. I'm about to get mine done. Man, you need to. It's like, no. Oh, nigga, don't try to motherfucking play. No, motherfucking Where's that sure at? Where Mr. Potato at? She up there, probably going to give him some head, something. Man, go ahead. I'm off this <laughs> motherfucker, man. Twelve o'clock. Don't y'all don't old people go to sleep at like nine, ten. Oh my god. What y'all wanna say? Oh, don't start them comments. Do not start those comments. And y'all know exactly what comments I'm talking about. Don't start them comments, bitch. It's only 11. Where you at? It's 12.05 here. Sing a song. Bitch, I don't sing. I be trying to. I know how to melodize. Melody, do my melody. Melodies. And I do that. But bitch, I do not be on here just giving no notes. If that's what y'all want, y'all need to go to Queen Page because she gonna hit them notes for y'all. I ain't hitting no motherfucking notes. I can do a little out of tune, a little ooh, ooh, ooh. Uh, yeah, out of other shit. Mm -mm. 
won't get a note out of me. What y'all over here saying? My laugh is so cute. Girl, I got like four different laughs. I got a I got a fake laugh like when somebody say some shit that's not funny and ain't nobody laughing, but I don't want them to feel lame, so I laugh. I be like <laughs> <laughs> that's that laugh but then when somebody say something that's just so funny and I be down there in tears I be like ah! And then I got another laugh because, like, sometimes, like, if I'm out or whatever, you know, with my boo or whatever, and he don't want me to laugh loud, I do a, a this other laugh. And this other laugh is kind of like, it's like a real sexy, but still loud. I'm like, I do that so which one you like because i got that was like three the first one the second one the third one which one you like the most number two i don't like number two Cause number two, every time I do number two, people be looking at me crazy. But it be like, damn, like what y'all want me to do? Thank you. Who that is, Naya? She said we like all of them. Thank you, boo. Thank you so much. Thank you. Let me see who else on here. Raising here. Ain't nobody else on here that I can fuck with. Everybody else look like they sleep or doing something. Yeah, I don't see nobody else on here. So... Y'all, I got to tell y'all uh, what happened to me today. So, y'all know I'm over here furniture in my room. One thing I don't like about doing my own furniture stuff is because it takes me a long time to do it because I'm very, I'm a very indecisive person. So, I'll see some shit that I like and then I'll change my mind tomorrow. And so when I do find some stuff that I like, I'll stalk it for like a couple of weeks and then I just go and buy it because I can't find nothing else that's <laughs> topping it. So I've been online like trying to find out what painting should I get in my room. So y'all know my bed is like all different kind of nudes and stuff, right? I feel like some people don't know when they turn So, my bed is all of these different colors of new, right? <laughs> now, I need a painting in my room that match my bed. I could have used the painting that was in my condo, but that painting got like blue, pink, orange, and like some other colors on there. And that's throwing my room off. Like it's not giving what it's supposed to give in here. Like it's making it look 
urban and I'm trying to go for really sophisticated white, classy, leaner, pussy type of vibes in here. Not like colorful, childish, like those type of colors. I'm trying to go for like all nude and just real clean. So I hit up this guy. I was like just searching online trying to find somebody to do painting. Bitch, I hit up this guy to do my painting, right? I was like, he was like, what do you want? Y'all know I'm extra as fuck and every my all my ideas is dramatic as fuck. Everybody that work with me, I always test their gifts. Like, I always make them do some shit that they ain't never done before. So, <clears throat> moral of the story is, y'all people out there, I don't give a fuck if I was Beyonce, bitch. Charge me like y'all gonna charge a regular person. Do not charge me what you charge Beyonce because, bitch, I'm not Beyonce. Or whoever the fuck, whatever thought in your head you thought. Don't charge me like that. Charge me like you would charge somebody that was working at McDonald's, somebody that was working at Checkers, somebody that didn't have a job, or just whatever situation may be. Charge me like you charge them. Don't look at my blue check, look at my followers, look at my business, look at all the shit that I got going on and make your assumption of what you want to charge me then. Don't do that. So, I hit up the guy. First of all, you could tell he kind of just started. He don't got a whole bunch of followers. He, You know, he, he, he practicing. I hit him up. I'm like, all right, um... I want to do this, 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 and this. Let me show y'all my idea so y'all can see. I'm about to show y'all my screenshot that I sent him, and I'm going to explain to y'all what I wanted my painting to be. Hold on. Where the fuck is the screenshot? Hold on. Hold on, wait. Hold on, wait. Hold on. Hold. All right, right here. Here it is. So, the idea I had for my painting was so ill. So, y'all see how the girl got all the faces, like all of her mood swings, right? So, I wanted him to create, create, create me a painting, but I wanted all the faces to be my face and I wanted them to be the different colors of my bed. Like all the heads be different nudes to match my bed. And the girl that's turned around, I wanted him to make it me, you know, put my neck tattoo that I have on the back and make the hair straight. Like, you know, make it look like me, make her brown, like make her look like me. So just basically recreate this painting, but me. And I was going to put it right there on my wall. Y'all would not believe the price that this motherfucker told me. Let's just guess. I'm going to give y'all a couple seconds to guess the price that this motherfucker told me. Can y'all guess? And how I take this off my screen now? Fuck. How I take this off? No, no. Y'all need to go up. Y'all talking about 2K. Y'all need to go up. Go up higher. Not no 1200 Nah, bitch. You know he ain't charged no damn 100 K. I would have slapped the fuck out of him. He said some dumb ass shit like that. I'm waiting. No, not 4K. Higher than 4K. Yes, bitch! This nigga told me 15000 Who the fuck 
are you to charge me 15000 for a motherfucking four foot fucking painting, nigga? That's a fucking house. That's a car. I can own a car. Like, what are you talking about? What are you talking about? And you know the type of person I am. Before then, when I didn't know the value of shit, I used to just pay shit and not, like, ask questions. Like, I literally just used to ask people how much it is and not ask questions. But since I became a business owner, I ask a whole lot of questions because sometimes people overvalue stuff and devalue stuff. And so you have to make sure when you're spending your money, and also, when you're making your money, you're keeping your money and you're spending it on stuff that's worth it and making sure you're not getting cheated. So I asked him, like, like what, like, what costs 15, what costs 15,000? Because for one, bitch, paint is a dollar. Paint is a dollar at Walmart, bitch. The canvas is. Those canvases that y'all hoes paint on, them shits is nothing but five, six, seven dollars. So in order to get all the paint that I need, everything that I need for this painting, like I guarantee you, you ain't gonna spend it ain't like this painting over here. This painting got a whole lot of colors in it. It got a lot of stuff going on. So the dude that did this painting had to get more paint. But still, that ain't a lot of paint. I say for material, he shouldn't spend more than $200 on getting material. Like, in as a painter, you already got a lot of these colors. So it ain't even like you finna go out to get mad colors. You already got paint brushes, so you're not finna have to go get paint brushes. The only thing that you really gonna have to go get is my damn canvas. And you are gonna have to get some paint. It depends on if I use more than more of one color. So what costs fifteen thousand? You stay in Atlanta, you ain't gotta ship the paint and I'm coming to pick it up. What costs fifteen thousand? You said it's going to take you less than a week to create it. What costs 15000 sir? I don't know how to take it off the screen. How do I take this off the screen? Hold on. Oh. What costs fifteen thousand? Bitch, that mother first of all, that painting over there is way bigger than the one that he's making me. And that one only costs eight hundred. So what costs fifteen thousand? Like I'm confused. I had a whole nother painting that was fucking for free that somebody did that was still took a lot of time. Like I understand, like I don't have a problem with paying people for their time. I don't have a problem with paying people their worth, but you're not going to overvalue some shit because who I am or what you see or what you think I got in my account or what you just want to make up. And then if I ask you for a price breakdown of, what everything costs and you can't even give me a price breakdown of where I'm spending my money yeah no you're dead dead dumb fried like you smoking dick if you think I'm finna pay that fuck no and then ask for a shout out and think I'm finna pay you 15,000 and you think I'm finna give you a shout out are you dumb where they do that at yeah no thank you like my budget for for that painting was a thousand dollars that's the most i've ever paid for a painting like everybody fucking paint the shit is too accessible everybody do the shit just like everybody do hair everybody do makeup everybody do nails like everybody do taxes everybody can be a realtor everybody like everybody do the shit like and everybody prices around the same shit. Like, 
don't overvalue shit. Like, I don't like shit. Like, like don't overvalue some shit that you know don't fucking cost that. <clears throat> That shit is crazy. Like, I can see if it was a paint, like, I'm telling him to paint my whole room, my whole bathroom, my whole downstairs. My, I can see if I told him to paint my face on Stone Mountain, Mountain. Like, some dramatic ass, just extra ass just over the top as paint my face on my driveway like i can see if i said some extra ass shit like that like okay the price is worth it like that's a lot but bitch a little small ass simple ass cute little painting in my room you got me fucked up <clears throat> bitch that's an ap that's a motherfucking cartier that's motherfucking three uh, Cartier bracelets. That's motherfucking one. <clears throat> that's about the price of fucking one three carat earring. Like, are you crazy? It ain't like that's the real paint in a Mona Lisa where I can go and get some money for the shit. There ain't nobody gonna buy that shit. I can't make no money off that damn painting. And you think I'm finna pay fifteen thousand? You got me fucked up. <clears throat> I pay for shit that holds value. If you ever see me spending some money, it's gonna be some shit that hold value. It ain't gonna be no shit that depreciate or some shit that I can't get my money back off of. And that's the way y'all asses need to think. When y'all get y'all first big checks or y'all lump sums of money, don't be out here letting these people tell you any and everything because these people is broke and they trying to get money. And they know you got it, so they trying to take it from you. And they ass be just telling you any fucking thing. And if you not smart enough to look up how much stuff costs or at least ask questions, you're going to get scammed out here. Like, everybody trying to make money out here. And you just don't need to be the one that get the guinea pig. You don't need to be the damn guinea pig. Ask questions. Always ask questions. If a motherfucker can't give you a price breakdown and a, le and a legitimate reason of why they shit costs what they cost, don't pay for it. <laughs> Now I heard talk about so okay, I, this is not funny, but it's funny. So this girl was like, I don't, I didn't see that coming, but somebody said that the nigga, some nigga commented, talk about so I buy it for you, and she talking about some boy, you pass doing your bills, <laughs> you buy the painting for her. <laughs> no, no. Y'all is crazy. How you know he passed doing his bills? You must be in the house with him. Because you show speaking very confident like you know his business. No, bitch. He didn't mean 1500 That nigga meant 15 k He put 15 k If he meant 1500 he would have put 15 Zero zero. He put fifteen k. He didn't put fifteen hundred. Yeah, I, I I ain't dumb. I know how to read.
So I don't hear saying. We just dropped the song. I hate when y'all ask that with the music. Like, we literally just dropped the song. Like, half of y'all asses don't even be listening. Some of y'all be really on that shit and listening to every single thing we drop. And some of y'all asses listen to shit two months later and be like, ooh, this fire. Like, yeah, duh. <laughs> <clears throat> You like the way I talk. Mm. Thank you. Girl, I ain't doing no damn talent show. I don't feel like hearing nobody got damn rappers sing or do whatever they're going to do because y'all know a lot of these people on here be cat. I'll do a talent show and there won't be no goddamn talent on this bitch. They'll be on this bitch bothering me, making me cuss their ass out. Ain't gonna be doing nothing. <clears throat> My throat is dry as fuck. Why is it so dry? Can y'all see the puppies? Girl, them dogs is asleep. I don't feel like going upstairs. I gotta go all the way upstairs to see them dogs. And Hazel don't even be liking when I'm around her damn dogs. I mean, not me, but she just don't like nobody to touch her dogs. Because they still newborns. They haven't even opened their eyes yet. I'm going to show y'all the dogs when they open their eyes. So when the dogs open their eyes, I'm going to show y'all them. <clears throat> I just told y'all on my story what I use for my hair. Y'all do not be listening. I be dropping jewels on y'all, and y'all still come back and ask me the same stuff. If you want to know what I use to grow out my hair, go look at my Insta story. We think Neiman is the daddy because um, the ears and the paws, like, they look like my son. So... Um, we think Neiman the daddy. We won't know until they open their eyes and like we really get a good look at them, cause like they still they so little like we can't tell. We ain't gonna know until probably about a week or two. But I think they my son, kids. I be trying to, sorry y'all, if y'all ever see me not talking, it's because I'm trying to read the comments. They be coming in so fast. I be trying to see what y'all are saying, so I'm making sure I'm answering everything. The hell? I hate live. I always be clicking shit and then it be getting stuck on my screen. Okay. Okay, what does it say? What is it? <clears throat> we got 10 dogs. That's how many dogs we got. We got 10. She had 10 dogs this time. I think she had 10 the last time. Or did she have 11? Mm -hmm. She had one of them. <laughs> oh, thank you, God. Y'all know what y'all need to start doing, too, for, like, people who run stores and e-commerce and stuff like that? Every time y'all get a sale, 
<clears throat> every time y'all get a sale, y'all should be like, thank you, God. That's what I be doing. Every sale I get, and you got to imagine, I get at least 100 sales a day. So I be like, thank you, God. Thank you, God. I be sending it every single time. I just close my eyes. I be like, thank you, God. And the motherfuckers just keep coming. Like, they just won't stop. Like, they just keep coming. Like, every time I say it, another one pop up. I was hoping <clears throat> he was on here watching me, but he not. So now I'm about to go see what the fuck he doing, because why you ain't on here watching me? Worry about what the fuck I'm doing. I got a problem. Yes, Salve is my song. That's the only like we don't dropped a lot of songs, but that's the only song that I really like. Like, like I really love because it was from like a a really raw moment. Like a lot of our other songs, like they just be recorded in like studios, but it be like we'll record all of them the same day. Like that was my first time recording one song that one day and recording it in the moment like i'm really feeling like that at that moment and i recorded it what is y'all over here laughing about y'all always laughing about some shit and i don't like that because i be feeling left out <clears throat> what is y'all laughing about All right, I'm getting sleepy. I'm about to go to sleep. <clears throat> when the bitch starts scratching her damn head, she's tired. 